Hello there. My name is Bart. And today, on Randomness with Bart, we're going to talk about the Fan Expo. The Fan Expo. The, uh, the sci-fi horror comic book anime convention coming up this weekend. It's going to be at the Metro Toronto Convention Center. And it's going to be pretty crazy. It's going to involve a uh, bunch of uh, bunch of celebrities are going to be there, signing autographs and selling a lot of selling a lot of stuff. It's going to be really really cool. Tricky Ricky seventy seven is going to go there. That's right. He's uh he's actually got a bunch of bunch of DVDs that he's going to get signed, or at least that he hopes to get signed at the uh, at the Fan Expo. It's going to be uh between Friday August twenty second. And up until and including Sunday, August 23rd. Oh, sorry, August 24th. It's going to cover the three days. And uh, it's going to be pretty, pretty spectacular. So who's, who's Tricky Ricky 77 looking forward to meeting? Well, take a look behind me here. You can see uh, some of the movies that he wants to get autographed. He wants to get signed. And I'll tell you right now, it should be pretty should be pretty exciting. Now, what you got here? Let's see. He's got uh, this person here. I think this person who's going to sign this one. Uh, her name is, can you see her name there? Right there. Tara Santana. Tara Santana plays in this. She's known for her B-movie roles. And a lot of classic, uh, classic B-movies there. Back in like the 60s, maybe. And this movie here is called Astro Zombies. It's a real schlock fest. Real bad movie involving look at that slashers and zombies and sexy ladies and stuff and uh, and it stars John Carradine and Tara Santana so Tara Santana is going to be there so Tricky Ricky's hoping to get this thing signed this movie here which she starred in and boy was she a voluptuous one back in the back in the late 60s so he's really looking forward to that she's got a Q&A session too they have Q they have Q&A question and answer sessions there and they're pretty exciting. Um, what else we got here? All right, we got uh, there's a movie uh, Star Trek Generations. Uh, remember that one when both uh, you know both kind of Star Trek Generations there they both kind of come together. The uh, the the people there, Captain Kirk and Captain Picard, both come together. So who's going to be there? Well, not one of these two guys, but Brent Spiner. Brent Spiner's going to be there, signing autographs and doing a doing a Q and A session. And uh, Brett Spiner plays Commander Data, Commander Data in the Star Trek series. So he is in this movie too, Commander Data, Star Trek Generation. So Tricky's, Ricky's hoping to have uh, have him sign this thing, this this DVD here. Ah, uh, what else we got here? Okay, these two movies here. There's the same actor, in both these two movies. These are two really really good movies, really good classic movies. We got Mississippi Burning. Really great movie. It was up for Best Picture. Uh, I believe it was in the 80s. And then uh, One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest. That won Best Picture. 1975. So who is in both these movies? Well, the guy's name is Brad Dourif. Brad Dourif was in both those movies. Yeah, he was in this one. He played uh, a detective. Kind of a, a racist detective who was part of, the, part of the Ku Klux Klan in that movie. Played a really evil kind of kind of guy in that one that you love to hate. And this one, he played uh, well. He played like a mental patient. He was in the, the hospital with that guy there, Jack Nicholson. And he was in the hospital there, and he had a stutter. His name he, his name was Billy, Billy Bibbit, I believe was his name. And he played like a mental patient, stuttering. He was uh, he was nominated for that. He was nominated for a best supporting actor for his role in One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest. So he's going to be in both of these and. For those of you who don't know, Brad Dourif, the guy in both these movies there, he also played the voice of Chucky. You know the Chucky, the uh, Child's Play movies? Yeah, this guy, the guy Brad Dourif, he played the voice of Chucky in the Chucky movies. So he's going to be part of the, the science fiction convention, and he's also part of the horror convention because of Chucky. And he uh, he also played in one of the Alien movies. I uh, can't remember which one, but he was in one of the Alien movies with Sigourney Weaver. So you done that. And the last one, but certainly not least, last and certainly not least there, uh, you can see me 
You can see me in the reflection there, huh? Ah, uh, Star Wars. The Star Wars trilogy, the originals. Do you know who, who's going to be there? Boba Fett. The actor who played Boba Fett. That's right. The actor who played Boba Fett's going to be there. Jeremy something or other. I always forget his name. But anyways, the guy who played Boba Fett, the bounty hunter. Remember the bounty hunter? Remember uh, Han Solo gets gets frozen in carbonite? Frozen in carbonite and then, uh, you know, he ends up going going with the bounty hunter there. To, uh, to Jabba's palace. Well, that's who's going to be there. The Jeremy guy who played uh, who played the bounty hunter, Boba Fett. He's going to be there signing autographs. So Tricky Ricky's hoping to get this thing autographed too. This thing here. I don't know if a black marker will work good for that though. Might have to get uh, some kind of silver marker for that there. You don't want those. You don't want those. Uh, one of those silver markers. I think they're like silver kind of. That might work better here because there's some black on there. I don't know if a black marker will work on that one. Uh, same goes for this one. Might have to use a kind of a silver kind of marker for that one. I don't think a black will look very good on that. Uh, should look okay on these ones though. Black should look okay there. So yeah, it's the it's the fan expo happening at happening uh, this weekend coming up. Cost like uh, well for a deluxe pass to get you into all, into all the good stuff. Cost you like uh, I don't know, I think it cost them like 55 bucks or something for a deluxe pass. That's for all three days. For all three days, Friday it starts at two in the afternoon, and uh, goes all all day Saturday and Sunday, pretty much. So now what I'm gonna do here, I'm gonna do I'm gonna start uh, just for kicks, just because my name is Bart and this is my show. I'm gonna show some clips from these movies of the actors that are gonna be that are gonna be at the at the fan expo at the conventions. We're gonna show you. Scenes from all these movies here, quick scenes from all these movies starring the actors that Tricky Ricky is hoping to get autographs from on all these movies here. So, uh, yeah, I think, what is it, six minutes? Holy cow, I've been talking for six minutes. Jeez, that's crazy. I've been talking for six frickin' minutes about the, about the fan expo. Oh, I'm getting so excited. Flop your arms if you're excited. Oh, yes. Come on, flop your arms if it's crazy. Oh, it's so crazy. Oh, yes. Flop your arms everything. It's crazy that I've been talking about this and showing these things for, for over six minutes. Oh, yes. Flop your arms. Come on. Come on. Flop your arms like me. Oh, yes. You know you love flopping your arms in the air. Come on. You can flop better than that. Come on. Oh, yes. Flop your arms. Yes. Flop your arms with Bart. Only on my show. Randomness with Bart. Oh, look at my arms flopping. Oh, yes, they flop really good. Oh, there we go. So, well, it's been over seven minutes now. I'm going to shut up now because you're probably getting sick of hearing my voice. Um, so, um, please see part two. This is part one. See part two. Well, I've got to show you clips from these movies of the actors that are going to be at the, at the Fan Expo, at the conventions. And Tricky Ricky will hopefully get their autographs and maybe even ask them a question or two during their question and answer periods. Should be very interesting. So, this is the end of part one. Please, please go on to part two where the excitement continues. Thank you. My name is Bart.